In my line of work, presenting the highest quality image is key. Start building your website today at squarespace.com. Use the offer code CARL to get a 10% discount. I'm Carl Taylor, and this is my Squarespace. Hi, I'm Carl Taylor. Welcome to my office and my desk. Um, we've recently been reviewing different things that we've purchased for the studio. Obviously, you know that we moved to the new studio this year. And um, today I'm going to review another important piece of equipment. Not an expensive piece of equipment, but a very vital one to my workflow. And it's one that I get asked about a lot. And that is how do you uh, manage your images, work with your images? How do you shoot on location? What do you do for your backups? That sort of thing. Well, let's talk a little bit about that. Um, recently, I purchased this system, the G Technology EV Drives. This is called the ATC drive, and that just means the all-terrain case. And that is basically, this is not the drive, this is a protective case around the drive. Let me show you that first of all. So basically, this unclips and opens up, and out pops the drive. So there's the drive, and this is a one terabyte drive with USB 3, so I can basically plug this into my computer, USB 3 into here and away we go. But even better than that, and this is why I love this, is we pop this back in here, lock it up, and I've got an integrated Thunderbolt cable that's part of the case. And that's absolutely fantastic because that means I can just pop this into my computer. I'm just going to put that into the Thunderbolt port here and I can access my data without having to take the drive out of the case, which is great because the case is the protection. That's the thing that I'm interested in. So the drive's just popped up on the desktop there and open it up and there's, there's my files that I've been working on, various things, you know, whether I'm doing a shoot on location on my laptop or whether I'm doing a, a presentation at a trade show or a lecture somewhere. I can have my slideshow or everything on this drive all nice and secure, or I can have it on the computer as well, and I know that I've got it securely as a backup on here. Now, let's talk about this ATC case and, and why that's beneficial to me. Let me just eject this drive. Um, so, this is what attracted me to this system. I'm quite clumsy, often, um, you know, traveling a lot, uh, bashing camera gear around, uh, taking my, um, laptop in my camera case and my drive in my camera case. This is getting bashed around a lot. This, let me just show you, has got um, a rugged protection. I can just throw this on the floor there. Absolutely no problem whatsoever. Um, that will work. Uh, pop that back in there. I'll pop that back in a second just to show you. Also importantly, dust protection, water protection. Um, you could be outdoors, you could drop your case. Let's look, look at this horrible rainy day today. Um, I'll just put this outside here. Oh, actually, the rain's, oh, there's a little bit of, oh, wait a minute. Let's get water. So this is totally waterproof. Look, pour that all over there. Boom, boom, boom. There you go, completely soaked that. And there's no problem, that data is gonna be completely secure. I'm probably best to dry that off a little bit. Now the most vulnerable point would be the uh, Thunderbolt connection where you're gonna plug it back into the computer. But you see it's got that rubber protection cap over the um, end of the Thunderbolt thing there. So I'm just going to dry that off, make sure that that is dry before I plug it into the computer. So we've thrown that on the floor, we've put it outside in the rain, we've poured water over it, and I'll pop that into into my computer again, and we'll see that drive. There you go, it's popped back up on the desktop. Open it up, there's my data, all 
sound and safe. So that is why I really love using these uh, G drives uh, in this ATC case and having the benefit of the uh, Thunderbolt connection on here. Now, I'll be honest with you, I don't think the Thunderbolt gives you full Thunderbolt speed, as it were, because it still relies on effectively, I think, a USB 3 connection, and the Thunderbolt is just more of a convenience thing. I could be wrong on that, but um, I'm, pr I'm pretty sure that's the case. However, I use this in conjunction with this little machine here, and this is the G Technologies EV dock and this is really interesting because basically I use this and this as a combination uh, in my workflow. Um, let me just show you, let me just quick uh, eject that for safety. This drive here is two drives, okay? So if I pop that out, you'll see this drive looks very similar to the one that was inside the ATC case. It has a USB 3 connection and it also has um, the interface here um, and that pops into the slot there but you see there's another drive here and I've got this configured in RAID 1 and that means that this drive is a mirror copy of this one so it's like my backup of what's on this one so I've got one terabyte of workable space usable data on here and I use this as a working drive because this is proper Thunderbolt speed, so I can use this for video, uh, editing, photography, whatever I, I want to use this for, and, and I've got that peace of mind that this drive is just constantly a mirror replication of this one, which is fantastic. But even better than that is I can take this case and use this case, take that drive out, and I can use this drive in here, and then I can pop this into the uh, computer, directly off of this Thunderbolt cable. And I can take this drive on location or any of the EV drives that I've purchased. And I can use that as my system of sort of working uh, workflow when I'm going on a shoot uh, and I'm doing it on location and I need the laptop. And then taking this drive back out of this case and popping it back in there as my backup system, which is absolutely fantastic. The other great thing about the uh, little EV dock it's actually quite compact and that's fantastic because it means I can easily plug that up, pick it up, put it under my arm and take it home with me if I want to work from home on my laptop as well. Um, or if I want, I don't even have to take the whole thing. I could just take this part with that drive in home with me, do some work in the morning, pop it back in here, knowing that my RAID 1 configuration is giving me the backup. Uh, pricing on these things, I don't know what it, what it is off the top of my head, but it's not expensive. Maybe we'll, we'll bring that up on the ticker tape on the screen for you, just so uh, we can give you an indication on pricing. But I think these are very economical for uh, what you get for value for money for your workflow, and they're very uh, rugged in this ATC case as well. We also use the uh, larger G-Speed big RAID uh, drives, the studio drives for our video editing workflow. Uh, that's a whole nother kettle of fish, so I'll probably cover that off in a separate video for you. Anyway, I uh, hope you found that information on my workflow useful, um, and we'll see you next time. Thanks very much for watching. My passion is photography. Whether shooting for clients or teaching students, the excitement of great photography never gets old. Check out my website for free training, a complete range of courses and even photography workshops. Thank you for watching.